brothers and sisters. The beasts have arrived. I've been waiting for this three weeks. And it's finally here now. Let's unbox it, see what's in there. And install it. There's, there's been a lot of rumors about this effing up your computer, but I'm gonna install it anyways. Let's get started. And see, it comes with the catalog, menu, screws, a wire, I have no idea what to do that to do with this. Two fans, push and pull fans, CPU socket, and the beast itself. I've never installed any computer parts. This is my first time installing a CPU cooler. If I mess up anything, I'm gonna have to kiss my computer bye bye for the next couple of months till I get repairing parts. So my motherboard is an Intel LGA 2011 socket, that's what it has. So I'm gonna be using this kind of socket placing type. I don't need a backplate for the motherboard because my motherboard already has it, so I don't have to open up everything. I also have to use this, I have no idea what to do with this yet. This is these wires are for the fans, and I need the screws and the beast. You can see that's the normal temperature of my processor with the current um, heatsink. If it goes anything above that, I'm gonna have to shut down the computer completely. Otherwise, my processor will fry. So it's time to get my baby out of the sleeping room. As you can see. My baby is asleep now and needs a surgery. Also needs a cleanup. Oh my god, I'm so scared right now. I've never done this. Let's get started, shall we? Full update. I brought my tools. Rusty old tools. I took out the liver. I took out the... What's that thing called? A kidney? And there's his stomach, her stomach, I mean. Now, that thing right there is a $500 computer part. That's the brain of your computer, but it's the heart of my baby. It's time to, to find a way to set this up. I didn't know that there's already a fan over there, so I'm going to have to do something about that. Do you guys want to see a piece of dust? <laughs> it's a little bit cleaner right now as you can see I'm gonna continue working and clean it up and hopefully install it by tonight and at the end of the video I really don't want to be disappointed at a fried CPU as you can see it's a mess in here I did install this with my brother of course you can't do it alone it's hard work mate these are the temperatures. I'm not so sure about this. I'm gonna have to make a few phone calls to see if this is normal, if this is not normal. And we'll see if these things get back to normal. Last test. Mess everywhere. I'm using Prime 95. This is a CPU. Um a CPU test this maxes out everything on the CPU and tells me the temperatures after that if it's good that means we're good to go if it's not I have to kill myself I'll see you guys after I put everything together again hopefully last dispatch of the day July 13th I changed my processor cooler. It wasn't a fun thing to do. And it's almost 2 a.m. I've been working on this since 6, so that's like 8 hours. Things are cleaning up. Still some works to do. After that, I'm gonna play some Battlefield. I know it's 2 a.m., but I'm gonna do it. I wanna stress, stress test the ish out of it. I hope you guys enjoyed this vlog.
and I'll see you guys in the next video. What kind of vlogs do you want to see next? Can't be with all of you. This is the last dispatch. Okay, guys. Everything is back to normal now. It is time to push the button. Oh. Everything looks... Looks like it's working. Yes, the fans are moving. Everything's going well. Okay. I'm gonna show you guys what I'm using for this wonder. CPU fan error, that's bullshit. The fan is running. See? Asus Ease Mod. Temperature 40 plus. See, one of my CPU fans is working very slowly. Standard. I wonder why. Hmm. Let's see if I can fix this. Oh, it's going up. Nope. Come on, baby. Move up, please. Let's see. CP fan profile turbo save and X. Let's see if it's gonna work. Oh my god, I had my life. Well, enough about that. I'm gonna fix it later on. I'm gonna have to fix it. This is the keyboard that I'm using. Chinese five dollar one. Let's look at the temperature. I don't want my freaking CPU to fry. Yep, that's that fan is not working properly. Turbo man. That's the mouse that I'm using. It's a $15 Chinese one. It's Relax. You never heard of that brand, did you? Relax. I'm using a mouse pad, Steel Series. I am using a Sennheiser 360 3D headset. Also a 5.1 speaker. Where is it? That's the other one. If you want to know why I changed from Cooler Master V6 to that one, it's because one of my fans were, were broken on my previous CPU cooler. That's why. I'm using a Bing 144 hertz, one millisecond monitor. Also, that's my internet. And that's probably about it. Also, as you can see, I don't have a second monitor right now. I'm working on something. I'll be using the laptop when I live stream. So I hope you guys enjoyed the video. I really hope that I can fix that. See you guys in the next video. Up on internet and I was doing one of the wires in wrongly. It was in the wrong place. I don't. I still don't know if it's in the right place. But let's test it out. God help us all. Oh my god. In the name of God. Look at that. Oh boy. I don't think I'll get any CPU errors anymore. Hopefully not. Hopefully. Oh, yep. 
Still need to find that CPU thingy. Extreme tweaker. Easy mod. CPU optional fan. 22,000. Oh, I'm gonna use this one. I get it. I get it. This car change and exit. I'm gonna. I don't know what to do. Okay, guys. There we go. Let's see if I can connect it in real time. There's a little pin over here. This is the primary CPU fan pin. I think this is it. Let's see. God help us all. Please. The CPU fans are quite fast now. The previous era we got was like the, the RAM, the fans were running at like 600 RPM, that's rotations per minute. But. Oh god, please. Yes! It is done! Finally! I'm gonna run Corsair Link um, program for you guys and we'll see if the RPM got any bumps in it. We also have a fan over here. That's why I love this case. We got two intakes and four outtakes. So we're gonna get um, air from here inside, from the side as well inside and the air will go out from above and to the side so that's like two four five there's six fans running in this case and it's dead silent Corsair gives you a, a software to use with this cooler it's amazing let's see our options now okay the pumps rpm is 2100 can I focus here okay 2179 this is my radian fan that's my average temperature 38 and fan 4 and 5 four, uh, fan 3 these are the CPU fans 942 by 902 it used to be like 600 to 500 so I guess we finally made it guys. Finally, thank you for watching and I'll see you guys in another vlog. Bye. Your brother. What the f That's some nasty shit. Is that a car?